Okay, hello everybody, and today we are starting a new game, The Crooked Man. And we're already running into technical difficulties. Fabulous. And it's shrunk, and it's back, and oh god. Oh, I had to hit enter, I'm stupid. <laughs> what a great start. There is a crooked man, and he walked a crooked mile. Oh, that's a little music. He found a crooked sixpence upon a crooked style. It's lovely. Very nice. He bought a crooked cat, which caught a crooked mouse. And they all lived together in a crooked little house. Ooh. I like this game. Aw, the music stopped. Oh goody. Whew, things finally look tidy in here. That should be that. Is there anything else we can help with, David? Nah, I'm fine. Sorry for making you guys help me move. And thanks for showing me the place, Paul. I'll have to pay you back sometime. Ooh, nice. The three of us should go out drinking. I look forward to it already. Well, we better get going. Got it. Be careful, you two. Well, that is lovely. Okay, what is this? Huh? Sheesh, Paul forgot his freaking gigantic ass license. I should get it back to him if he's still around. Yippee. What do I got in here? Uh, that's all I got to say about that. What about this gigantic ass crack in the wall? Yeah. Okay, uh, well, I guess we better give Paul back his license if I can get in the door because I am so bad at games. Oh no, I skipped dialogue. You hear someone. What's with that place? Seriously? It's filthy. It's practically falling apart. What were you thinking? He wanted to move for a change of pace, and that will not help him. You hear? Look, what can I do? He's not the richest guy, you know. Can't even afford much furniture. Besides, you told me to look for the place, right? Don't come complaining to me now. Well, shit. You're right. I'm sorry. I just wanted to help David out. I know. Look, I should be sorry. We'll visit some other time. So that was, uh... That was the people who were just here talking about me. Well, shit. The license can wait, I guess. Better get to bed. Okie dokie. Do I have a... Ooh, hello. Now I'm gonna make some YouTube videos on my... Windows XP... No? Okay. Put it in here. Aha! I found the sh That is the weirdest looking sink I have ever seen in my life. Oh, it's a washing machine! Oh, of course, this is the fucking sink. I'm a idiot. A wash basin. Fancy. Can I take a shit? Don't want to go. Well, shit. I'll get it. And... Oh, better answer to cell phone. Oh, no, I skipped whatever that was. Hello, who is this? Shirley? Beep, beep, beep. Well, that was creepy. Thank you for that random call. I should just call it a day. I should take it easy for my first day in the new place. Okay, well then, I guess we will not go to bed and look at everything before we go to bed. Okay. Uh... What is this? Oh, that's a stove. And we here we have the beautiful soup. We have no dishes, but, uh, ooh, we can watch them. That is the weirdest placement for a TV. I'm a weird person. I'm picking out the weird things. An empty trash can. Well, okay then. Time to go to bed. That's an Oh no. Okay. I did it. I need to be more careful because I keep skipping things. That I don't mean to skip. Oh, what the fuck is that? Um, really? Is somebody, is that somebody crying? I can't sleep through this. Is it one of my neighbors? I should go complain. 
Uh, that is unsettling. Wait a minute. It sounded like it was coming from back in the house. Like it sounded like it was coming from the bathroom or something. Maybe it's this asshole. It's you, isn't it? I love the knocking. Yes, who is it at this hour? Pardon me, it's just... I can hear you from my room, even. It's making it hard to sleep. Would you stop? Huh? What are you saying? I was asleep until you woke me up. You trying to start something? You're the guy who moved into 205, right? There's no way you would hear me from there. Eh, uh, I guess so. Sorry for waking you. Bye now. She's right. The rooms are pretty far apart. More importantly, it was a man's voice. Was it just my imagination? Whatever. I better get back to sleep. La 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 la. Time to go to bed. Right then. It was in the bathroom! What's going on? What's going on? Oh, that's creepy. I knew I thought it was coming from the bathroom. I was right. Oh my gosh. Um, I'm gonna, I'm gonna have to go ahead and say no thank you um, on that one. Under the bed. Is Paul trying to prank me? Talk about bad taste. Uh, yeah. Can I just go? No, there's a reason to go out. Um, you just don't really see it apparently. Wait, there's somebody hiding in this room? No. Okay, well. Um. How do I look under the bed? Okay, I guess I'll just completely ignore and go back to sleep then. Under the bed, huh? What's down there? Mm. Hmm? Found something. Got a scrap from a notebook. Ooh. Story time. Ever since she went away. I've spent every night clutching my sweaty pillow and writhing. I can't say goodbye. What other choice do I have? What's this? Did the former tenant leave this? Okay, whatever. I'll get back to bed. Oh, that was lovely. I am so happy I read that beautiful notebook scrap. Oh god, that's creepy again. Where is that coming from? Give me a break, I need to sleep. God, that's creepy. That's not creepy at all. Nope. Ah, God, that is so loud. Pick up the phone! Hello? Uh, yeah, thanks for all the... Oh, is that supposed to be them talking? Because that sounds weird as shit. No, no, I didn't mean just... I'm busy with work, so... Yes, I'll come visit today. Tell her that for me. Okay, bye. Who are we visiting? Man, I slept into noon. I better go. So much for taking it easy. I mean, sleeping into noon kind of... Just taking it easy, but okay, okay. Uh, I wonder where we're going. Oh, hey, it's Paul. Right? Yeah, Paul. What is it? Yeah, yeah, uh, I forgot my lessons yesterday. Was it on the table? Oh, yeah, this. Sorry, I was going to bring it to you, but... Woo, thanks! So, you going somewhere? Yeah, to the hospital. I see. Take care of yourself, buddy. Oh, yeah, Paul, did you write something on the bathroom mirror? Huh? Right on the mirror? What kind of childish brat do you take me for, David? So sorry, I didn't mean it like that. Anyway, I'm off. Okay, I guess we're going to the hospital. Uh, ooh, there's a beautiful picture here. Do I need to go in there? I love that sound. Sounds a little bit more like, uh, Insane Asylum, rather. Oh, look, we can go in here. Oh, it's walking by itself now. Okay. Mom, it's been a while. Are you doing okay? Oh my. 
But isn't little Timmy? You've certainly grown. Good, you look healthy. Sorry I can't see you very much. I've been busy with work. Who's Timmy? But I took a few days off, so I moved to this great room with furniture and everything. It's near your favorite cake shop, too. So when you get better, we can live there together. My, that's wonderful. Get along with Linda, will you? All that fighting you do worries me so. Maybe I can come visit you sometime. You like apple pie, don't you? I'll make the best I know how. Mom, I'm not Timmy. I'm your son, David. Remember? Oh, she got like Alzheimer's. Well, this is sad. <laughs> Shit. Oh yes, they opened a bakery the other day. It smells so wonderful. Maybe I should buy from there. Mom. Oh, who would you be? Why are you here? How did you get in? This is my room. Do you have the wrong room? Who are you? Say something, will you? Ma. Get out! I'll have you thrown out! Somebody! Somebody! There's a strange man in my room! Get rid of him now! Mrs. Hoover! Mrs. Hoover, please don't strain yourself. Please go to sleep, okay? Who are you? Don't touch me! Get away! Now calm down, miss. Let's get you into bed. I'm sorry, David. Leave your mother to us. You'll have to leave for today. Understood. Take good care of her. Davy? Is that my Davy boy? Where are you going? Why are you leaving me? Oh, this is sad. <gasps> Mom? Your flight school exams are coming up. You want to be a pilot, don't you? Your mother always has your back. Please don't leave me alone. I don't want to be alone here, Davy. Please. Mom! It's me, remember? Mom? David, please leave. She's very confused right now. But, but she said my... I said leave! Oh, God. Miss Hoover, please calm down. Bring the sedatives. Okay, well, thank you for that extremely loud scream. I loved it so much. Oh, hi, Santa Claus. How are you doing today? Hello, David. Did you see your mother? Yeah, but I guess she still doesn't know me. Yes, she's forgotten many things. And she's having trouble controlling her emotions. I ask you to be patient. She may well get better, so you can live with her again. Thanks. I hope you can help her. And we're going back home. Yay! Back home. Well, that was sad. And that's nice. What the fuck was that? Nope. That's a pretty good reason to go out. That fucking terrifying death howl of Satan was a pretty good goddamn... Wait a minute. Wait a minute. I didn't look in here last time. Okay. Okay. That, uh... Okay, nothing terrifying and deadly in here. Really? Nothing? Just just the death hell of Satan? What, what, what are we gonna do now? Comforts, you don't say we wanna watch some uh, Netflix, no? Wanna grab some turkey sandwiches? Nope. How about cook some mac and cheese? Wash some dishes? Uh, I don't know what to do then. Uh, use some tissues for the, t for the feels that just popped up. Call Santa. I don't know what to do. I'm just going back to sleep, apparently. No, I can't go back to sleep. Shit. What do I do? Maybe I can make some YouTube videos now. Oh, I didn't even notice the chair moved. Hmm, there's something in the drawer. Got a leaflet for school. Looks pretty old. Hmm, these LLM courses are circled. Was somebody shooting to be a lawyer? I guess this must be the former tenants. We sure forgot a bunch of stuff. Maybe no furniture is better after all, huh? Okay, then. 
Do I have to take a shit now? Don't want to go? What about the sink? No? Uh, what about uh, the beautiful washing machine? Wait, there oh, whoa, 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 I didn't know I could do this. Shower, let's take a shower. We smell stinky. Can I actually get in? It looked like steps. Nope. Okay, well, maybe there's something in the main room now. Hey, phone call. I am horrible at these. Hello? Hey, David, how are you doing? Haha, <laughs> you saw me just yesterday. I'm doing fine, thanks. Good, good. Call if you're lonely, okay? And by the way, I got a call from Shirley yesterday. We didn't really talk, but... S sorry, I told her your number. She said she was worried about you. It's okay. Tell her I don't need to worry. She should just look out for herself. Alright. Well, I'll hang up now. Alright, see you. Quadruple dot. Ooh, we got some delicious food. Oh no, this is tea and books. I'm stupid. I thought it was food. Tired of reading. I should go to bed. Okay, well, let's go to bed then. Ah, oh, what the? Why did it turn on by itself? Is it broken? Ah, uh, no. That, oh. Okay, that's it. sink. Gah! What the shit was that? What? This is creepy. Apparently we are playing the most haunted house in the world. Uh, did it say sink? What was that? No, well, I think I know what to do here. Hmm? There's a scrap of paper under here. Got a scrap of paper. Yippee! There was a crooked man. The hand he walked a crooked mile. He found a crooked sixpence up against the crooked style. He bought a crooked cat, which caught a crooked mouse, and they all lived together in a crooked little house. Well, that is great. Isn't this a mother goose run? Why is this here under the sink? I guess the previous tenant? This is so strange. I should sleep and forget about it. Hell no, you shouldn't sleep. You're fuck. There's some demons in your house, man. This is the time to go and uh, just go. No, no. Okay. The the, de the death of the magical TV telling you the location of magic crap and uh, you know just the devil. What's on a reason go to sleep? Okay. Moving for a change of pace, huh? Guess that's not working so well. I appreciate Paul and Marion's help, but. Okay, that's creepy. People always cry. Is that a kid out here? What kid would leave in this beat up apartments? Heck, maybe they're lost. I should go check. Uh, you should definitely not go check. Um, this time I'm gonna check in these rooms. Okay, nothing here. Nothing here. Okay, he's walking by himself again. Of course there's no kids here. Must be getting tired. And that kid- Ah, oh, what the fuck? David. Had a shit in his pants. Uh, what is good? Oh no, my coffee! Just a broken cup. Jeez, that startled me. <laughs> Wait, what? Nope! Nobody, no, 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 no. That is, that is not okay. Why, why would they do that? The coffee says you gotta be. This room is really, really strange. With its voices and TVs turning on, the demons on the ceiling. What is this? Uh, hi, Paul. It's David. Yeah, what's up? Man, you sound sleepy. <laughs> uh, yeah. Um, I was up all night. I gotta ask you something. Is that okay? Yeah, what? Do you know who used to live in this room? Nah, I don't know. Yes, landlady? Curious about something? Well, seems like he forgot a lot of stuff. But I'll ask the landlady. Sure. Later. Okay. The landlady's on the far end of the first floor. I'll go see what she knows. 
But I guess it's time to go see that fan lady. Ooh, we actually get to go downstairs. So would that be this door? Nah. Oh hey, another crack. Oh wait, can we do something with you? Hello! Oh, it's Mr. David! What seems to be the matter? Good day, miss. I just wanted to ask him something, you see. About the room I'm in. Can you tell me more about anything? Retard moment. Can you tell me anything about the person who used to live there? Um, well, you know, these apartments always have people coming and going. Now, what was that boy's name? I believe he was a man about your age. He suddenly left about a month ago. Said to leave the furniture and use it, however. You wouldn't know where he went? I never heard that, no. Really just up and left out of the blue. I just can't remember that name. I could rummage through my documents to find the previous tenants if you'd like. No, there's no need. I was just a little curious, thanks. I'll see you around. Alrighty. Sorry I wasn't very useful. Okie dokie. Uh, a man about my age. I can only wonder. Oh well, I'll get back to my room. I heard this curse by David. Yep, sounds great. Nope! <laughs> oh, what was that? What was that? Can I interact with that? No. Uh, nobody hiding here? Okay. And it goes right to the crack. Why are these tracks on the floor? They lead up to this wall. Is there something in this crack? Oh, cool. I got a key. I wonder what it's for. The key? Well, I guess I won't read that. The guy's voice, the kid's voices, the mirror writing, the TV turning on, the coffee... Huh, it's like a poltergeist or something. I would have thought the lady would have mentioned this kind of thing. What's going on here? Yes, the landlady would definitely mention the demons hiding in your wall. Uh, not that I care if there were ghosts here. I wouldn't much care if they haunted and killed me either. Wow, this just got dark. But I wonder about that scrap of paper. What was the man who lived here like? Did this stuff happen when he was here? If it did, he got smart and left. Not much use thinking about it. I'll call it a day. Okay. Ooh, and, uh, we are actually going to have to stop recording. And, uh, leave off. That will be the end of this episode. I'll see you guys in the next one. And, thank you for watching, and goodbye.